It's the kind of thing that could land you in serious trouble in most countries. But here in Uruguay, growing, selling and consuming cannabis is now legal. The first country in the world to opt for full legalisation. This is chocolate number six, chocolate. LA, Confidential. LA Confidential. The law allows a cannabis club to have as many as 99 plants of varying strengths and properties. And supporters deny charges it will boost the illegal trade in drugs. Quite the opposite. The best way of fighting the crime is this, you know, uh, attacking the, the business, not the people who consume, not the user or the grower. You need to attack the business in taking customers away from crime. Supporters say this is much more than a hippie's charter, a license to get high. Uruguay is now in a unique position to develop and exploit the commercial and medicinal uses of cannabis as well. Just across the border in Brazil, Margarete Brito is frustrated. She knows that cannabis extract, or CBD, helps cut the number of Sofia's epileptic attacks. But getting hold of CBD isn't easy, and is certainly no off-the-shelf remedy. I'm always trying to find people who are traveling so that they can bring it in for me. And when I can't get hold of it, we have to find a courier. What's in here is a dilution of three parts olive oil to one part cannabinoid oil. Even in some U.S. states like Colorado, where cannabis is legal, federal law prohibits medical trials with a drug. So some producers are here in Uruguay. Once we move beyond anecdotal evidence through the clinical trials about to happen in Uruguay, everything that happens here is going to be watched very carefully by other countries. And I believe they will follow suit if good results are found. By awarding licenses to two companies to grow cannabis commercially, Uruguay's radical marijuana legislation is now almost complete. New businesses are growing, and in addition to medical trials, tax revenues could be worth millions. Many other countries are keeping a close eye on Uruguay's controversial experiment with weed. Wira Davis, PBC News, Montevideo.